Hello everybody, it's Brett here, Lionheart84. I think my neighbour's just temporarily stopped his drilling and cutting so I can squeeze in a quick two minute video. Um, just thought while I'm moving plants around and making a bit of space that I'd just do a quick uh, close up video on my largest grafted pawpaw, that's like Acemina trilobra, and this variety is Prima. Now, interestingly, it's grown quite nicely now. I mean, for the end of May, it's doing very well. But it is actually still... Last year, it had a couple of embryo fruits, which it dropped in June. And again, it's got a couple on this year. But, of course, typically enough, just as I want to try and film them, the wind's blowing, which means I can't... can't get the camera to focus can't even see the sun shining in my eyes I can't even see where the damn things are um, let's see if I can get a bit closer no, even if the camera can see them I can't because I'm being blinded by the sun but under there oh there they are under there I've got a couple of embryo sized fruits which is what I had last year and in about a week's time they dropped off I'm expecting the same thing to happen this year but I guess you never know there's always an outside chance that they might hold on there's a pair up there as well again the wind's blowing the branch around and the camera won't focus but I've got about three or four embryo sized fruits on this tree now it's got quite a substantial stem now it's probably about an inch wide at the base so it probably could hold one or two fruits I've just noticed a couple down underneath much smaller ones that I'm able to get a picture of because the fence is behind and there's no sun shining in my eyes that's the size I got about three or four to last year and then they all dropped off or got knocked off by birds so I'm not expecting any more this year because it's still quite a young tree I've only had, I've had this um, maybe two years I've had this one I think but it's in quite a substantial container so I am hoping that it will survive for a few years in here and I might possibly get two or three fruit on it because obviously I've never been able to try poor poor because we don't have them they're not available in this country they don't ship the fruits they only uh, they only last for about a week so they're not something that's uh, shippable overseas but that's my largest grafted pawpaw, that's, uh, that variety is Prima, Latin name Acemina triloba. It's a lovely plant, lovely leaves, very, very hardy, but whether or not I can get ripe fruit in this country remains to be seen because our summers can be a bit lacking. But we've had a really good start this year with an amazingly warm May, so maybe miracles will happen. Anyway, thanks everybody for watching. Please do remember to like the video, share it with anyone who you think might be interested. Please subscribe to my channel if anything I'm growing might be of interest to you. And uh, please, if you do remember to click on the bell, you will get updates about future videos that I, uh, that I post throughout the summer. Let's see if we can get that to focus or not. It's really annoying when they, uh, the wind stops the camera focusing. Anyway, catch up with your next video. Brett out for now.